Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. As promised, this is Rusty78609. Now I'm going to show you the living area in my tiny home, which is probably about 144 square feet, 12 by 12 approximately. But anyway, as we move into this luxury, try to control yourself. I'm not trying to make you jealous, but be that as it may, it'll be hard not to. But having said that, right here on the left, there's a little folding table that I used when I was camping with a blue eddy on it and the charger and stuff behind it. Why do I have it there? I don't even know where to put it unless it's on the bed. And then uh, right next to it is another kind of miscellaneous shelf that I made. Well, I built. Amazon sent it to me. But it's a metal shelf, and it works really good. It's got. I want to be able to see where everything is, you know what I mean? And if those shelves are solid, then I can't see. But you know, but the way it is now, I can tell where I've got everything. You know, Those are like dust rags, and that is too. And then there's some miscellaneous stuff in there, and that's a little coin thing and my eyeglass cleaner and stuff like that. And then on the wall over here, of course, I have a like a bulletin board. That's an erase, erasable a bulletin board. And uh, a lot of things on there are going to change. But anyway, and then up here, I've got my keys. I come in and out. I've got keys. And if I need them, they're just right there handy. So then, of course, you know what that wall over there is. That's all the stuff. And then the table there has uh, the Google Home device. And there's my laptop. And, you know, somebody made me those little... Uh, towel looking things with my initial on them rusty and it's like a starburst yeah they're really nice whoever did that thank you very much and then i've got one of those plastic chair pads for the office chair because on this carpet the chair didn't roll very well at all so i got one of those office chair pads works great and uh, what else can i show you this tv is mounted on a a stand that's got rollers on it so i could move it anywhere i wanted to but as it turns out i don't need to because what i can do uh, the way I've got this set up now is this thing turns. I can take the TV. Well, I can just put my foot on it here. In fact, I'll do it right now if I can. But you just you just turn it. I say you just turn, turn it. Well, it ain't turning now. Is it? No, it ain't. Why not? I don't know why not. Well, it was turning this morning. Let me see if I can do it this way. Over here. It'll come. Well, it ain't doing There it goes. There it goes. You just kind of turn it around like this here. You know what I mean? and get it facing the other chair. So that way I don't, you know, I just have the TV in one spot and see now it's kind of facing this chair over here and that's where I sit and watch movies. Over here in the mornings when I'm having breakfast, I can turn it back and uh, and watch whatever I want to watch while I'm having my breakfast. Of course, I've got a ceiling fan there that's reversible and a ceiling light. I don't have it. I could have turned it on. It would have given me more light, I guess. And then, uh, you know, those wooden things over the windows, I don't know why they're there. They just are. Do they bother me? Not now. I've gotten used to them. And then down here, of course, we've got some electrical outlets. And this right here is a oil field uh, heater thing, radiator. And, uh, yeah, it works okay. And it, the reason I've got it right there is uh, it's just you know, on a cold morning, you turn that on and, and the heat it radiates on me right there while I'm doing comment call and stuff. And then over here, of course, that's uh, some cards and letters for mail call. I let them stack up and then I do them. And then over here is the electrical thing, the charge surge protector and stuff. And I have those little tacks there so I can hold. That's the charger for the phone. And then this thing here is the charger for the laptop. And it hooks on that little tack right there. So everything's right there. And I've got me a little compass so I know which way west, north, and east is and all that stuff. And there's my stand for doing comment call. That's two bush refried bean cans. And I just set that little thing right on top and we're good to go. Pretty low budget operation, right? But having said that, there's a little, uh, I've had that, that little step stool, that's a foot stool in front of the, in front of the rocking chair. And is that thing comfortable? It is with those pads on it, very comfortable. And then I put my books that I read on this table over here. And then over here, I've got the controller for the TV. And of course, that's just napkins and stuff. And that one right there, sometimes I put my laptop on there. Like if I sit down here to eat a meal, then I put my laptop over here to get it out of the way. And you know what most of that stuff is. And that I call a banjo, but I know it's a ukulele, but banjo is much easier to spell. And this is the work of art that an individual sent me. Thank you very much. And there's a couple of outdoor hats. And this right here is a, uh, a vent fan. You know, you put it up in the window and it sucks the air out. I was going to put it in the bathroom, but I don't need it. My shit doesn't stink, so to speak. No, I'm just kidding. But anyway, no, it does. But I just, it really didn't work the way I planned. So it's just sitting there looking at me like, well, why'd you buy me? And I keep saying, I don't know. 
And then, of course, we have a, a, a window AC in here, another 6,000 BTU uh, AC in the living area, which I don't know if they ever need it, might. And what else? You know, of course, you've got that's the mirror from the bathroom. We'll do that later on. And then, of course, I've got a clock there. That's I, I, I don't do daylight savings time, so that's whatever normal time is. And the temperature shows to be about 65 in, degrees in here right now. But anyway, that's the living area, guys. Not very big. And I'm glad. And uh, yeah, it works for me. It works for me. All this works for me. And uh, yeah, and, and those two little end tables, those two little tables beside the chair worked out perfectly because see, if you, if I tried to put everything on one, it was too cluttered. I mean, I, or I couldn't find the stuff real easily. And so this way I got, having too much space is never a problem, I don't think, unless you're heating and cooling it. But as far as storage space, I don't know. I think, I think you're okay there. But anyway, yeah, so I got that and that. Rocking chair, muy bueno. And, uh, yeah, kind of the red, white, and blue thing. This is blue, I guess, red, white, you know, very patriotic. But, yeah, having said that, guys, and those windows over there, they look kind of dirty, and they are. <clears throat> I mean, I've cleaned them inside and out, and they're still kind of hazy because they're really super double-pane windows, and uh, they got about a half-inch gap between them, and I don't know how you get in there to clean them on the inside, but to do it, you'd probably have to replace them, and I'm not going to fool with that. They're, it's fine with me, guys. You know, it's functional. And then there, of course, is a little trash can. And uh, there's a rock. I don't know what you call it. But they, they, people look for stuff out on the road and stuff. And Anyway, enough said about that. What else can I tell you? Uh, things are changing, guys. I'm changing again. I'm, you know, we're, I'm, I'm making some minor changes in my lifestyle. Uh, why? Just because the hell I want to. And uh, we'll, we'll get on that sometime this week or next week. And I'll give you a heads up on that. Maybe I'll do it at Beer 30 this week. But, uh, yeah, I've come up with a semi-new plan, not anything dramatic or drastic, but a minor adjustment. But anyway, guys, from uh, my luxurious tiny home in central Texas, or excuse me, southwest Texas, near Brackettville at Fort Clark Springs, on a very nice day. Uh, I mean, for this time of the year, it's unbelievable. It's supposed to be like 85. But anyway, thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye-bye, buy anything you want. Anytime, but if you think about it, use the link to Amazon products in the description of all of my videos. Why? Because it doesn't cost you one penny. And uh, I'll focus on this work of art, and y'all can see that while I'm ending the video. So he did a great job. I'll try to get my shadow out of the way. But yeah, uh, what else? Drink plenty of water, stretch, walk, st walk, stand guard at the door of your mind, and enjoy your life the best you can. And one of these days, you'll be an artist like this individual right here. Adios, guys. Enjoy your life. Bye-bye. Boom. Ha, <laughs>